are one gorgeous weirdo. Thanks. One more thing. You guys have to rough me up and make it look good. I, I don't think I can do that. Pussy. Get the hell out of here. We owe you dinner. I heard threesome. Welcome back to another episode on Beho Reviews in Gaming and Entertainment. In this episode, we take a look at one of my all-time favorite television series to date with Archer Season 13. Being a huge Archer fan from its inception way back in 2009, I couldn't wait to see the story evolve until the series took a huge chance with Archer in a coma and having a several seasons based on his dreams while being under. Once he awakened, I truly wondered where the story would head as Archer was at his most vulnerable, especially with his mother, Mallory Archer, leaving the show due to the voice actress, Jessica Walter, passing away in real life. I truly wondered, was this really it? Thankfully, with season 13, I feel that the series has gotten back on track and made some new decisions on the story, which I feel was made for the better. Archer Season 13 was produced by FX Productions and released by 20th Television for the FXX Cable Television in 2022, with 8 episodes through October 12th. Each episode is between 20 to 23 minutes as your average half an hour television affair. The story begins right after Season 12 with Mallory leaving to enjoy her life and retiring leaving Archer for the first time in his life without her looming over him as his main boss. Now, with the agency being acquired by season 12 villain Fabian of the IIA, the team is sent through various missions to an endgame at the very end to try to win back their independence. What the series has done is just pretty much go back to basics and what made Archer incredible from the start as the badass world's greatest assassin with an ego to boot. No more do we see the hurt and exposed Archer after his coma where he pioneers his place in the team. He is well aware that he's the best and acts as such, brings back that charismatic look, attitude and ruthlessness with a touch of caring is what made the series so great. What the biggest change is that instead of going on missions primarily with Lana with the rest of the characters as support, the entire cast is on every mission and actually plays an integral part of the story whether positive or negative. Each character now contributes in each episode and truly gets into the action along with Archer as a full-fledged spy team. Not only is this fantastic to see how they all get along together again, they go through the ups and downs a team goes through to get through each mission. This allows so much more character development and interaction, making the writing here some of the best I have seen in a long time for the series. As much as I love the deeper Archer from season 11 and 12, I feel that this Archer is one of the better iterations with non-stop banter with his team. Of course, the series just doesn't have great writing and pacing for the season, it also has the same expected whimsical and impossible action. There wasn't a time so far this season where I thought the episode was just passable. I thoroughly enjoyed the action sequences making the season a breath of fresh air in combination with the story overall. As usual, the voice acting here is superb, as every character just makes sense along with the new villain, Fabian, who also is becoming a favorite of mine as his character as well as the others are fleshed out even more this season and I loved him every bit as much as the rest of the cast. Overall, the series took a lot of hits going in the direction that they did as they made the story before and post Archer's coma, with the series going in the direction they are now with fantastic writing, going back to the basics, really shines on the real reason why this series lasted so long in the first place with new life and a whole team instead of just one to contend with. This is definitely going in the right direction. Archer Season 13 gets an 8.5 out of 10 for its fun getting back to basics comedy and ruthlessness with fantastic writing and a great cast of characters. That's it for this look at Archer once again. Please like and subscribe if you like my videos. Beho out and Greg take us out of here and I will see you all next upload.
Just think my written test score is getting in the way of a promotion. Oh, that's not important. Okay, being a field agent isn't about written tests. I also did bad on the skills part. Um, that's less not important. So let's practice. You see him. You say. Um, stop. You're under arrest. Okay, are, are you asking me or are you telling me? Telling? Wait, no. Asking. Damn. Uh. Yeah. Uh. Yeah. Uh.